Shiver me timbers and welcome me buckos to my World of Tanks video. There's the Jolly Roger. So I wanted to show you my progress that I made on long haul. So we can go, let's go and do this here in the seasons. So we go to seasons, go down to more challenges, click the A button, slide on down, long haul. As you can see, this is my second long haul. It'll tell you operation details, one out of two. So I got the first one. I'm going to show you the card that I got. At this point, I have 12 out of 75 to get the second and final card of the week. So let's go see. Now, personally, I'm not really doing any of the other ops this week. I did string theory yesterday, getting two accidentally. I was just, you know, all you do is you win five, you get a medal. You win six, you get another medal. You win seven, you get another medal. It goes until you stop winning, basically. So I don't know what the record is. It's got to be pretty high. 10, 12, I, I have no idea. It's probably hard longer than that. But that covers that part. This is the, you know, last week of the evolution season. So you're seeing that. If any of you guys are still finishing off this season, kick butt because Monday night it's going to be done. You got to make sure you get to stage 100 so you can get the Magok. This is the Super Sherman. This is the Magok. The Cold War Era 2 butt kicker medium. That's the one that you see with my Jolly Roger. Just giving you a helpful hint there in case you're still in progress for some reason. Really awesome stuff. Oops, let's get out of here. Um, now, what was it going to do? Oh, I'm going to show you long haul card. So let me pause this. I'll be right back. Slower. This would be me booty. After I finished my long hauls. So let me show you what I got from this guy. I'm going to pause this again so I don't waste your time. I'll be seeing you in a second. This is the prize contained within that card. So on the blue cards, you get a guaranteed 150 gold check. Unfortunately, I didn't get more, but hey, you know, whatever happens, happens. Free gold is free gold. 400 XP, not terrific by itself. However, I will show you the things that I got out of my XP. So let me tell you about XP. Free XP is something you hoard. Do not use it. To cheap your cheap complete upgrades on your tanks it's a huge mistake and I'm going to show you why that would be a huge mistake so when you get free XP go okay 400 fine great my friend he got some cards and I'll hopefully send show you a video of those and elaborate on those but so we hoard the free XP I have about I think 10,000 I'm not sure exactly but the prime thing that I got was, of course, one day of premium. A day of premium is about 100 gold, okay? So that's 100 gold I didn't have to spend on premium. And those premium days, if you're aggressive in seasons, as well as long hauls and your ops, you can be like me. Now, let me show you. I'm going to get out of here and back out. Pardon me. Back out to the uh, garage. Now, you see it up right-hand corner. It says I have 21 days. Now, about five or six weeks ago, I bought a week, the, the week of premium. Let me show it to you. It's in the store right now. If you haven't bought it, you can only buy this once. I didn't know that. I was going to buy it the other day. And it says, hey, owned bundle, it won't let me buy it. I can only gift this to somebody else like this. I can send a gift to somebody, but I can't buy it for myself. It's a ripoff. It's useful. Very good. If you haven't bought this guy and you have something coming up, like this would be a tremendous thing if you don't have any premium time. Here's a helpful hint. Now, I don't know what your goal situation is, but... Let's assume, for argument's sake, that your 
getting ready to buy the season pass for next season, which will start next Tuesday. Let's say you don't have any gold and you don't have any premium. What you need to do is at this point, you would need to buy enough gold or buy cards. It's up to you. Uh, cards is a gamble. You can gamble and win or you can gamble and lose. That's your business. Um, I don't buy straight gold myself. I gamble on cards. That's just me. So let's say I didn't have any, but I needed the normal price for seven days of gold uh, premium, twelve fifty. Ouchie. All right, that's an ouchie. I'm going to tell you this: I will never pay for seven days. Rather than seven days, I'd pay double and get thirty. That's just me. So if I get in a in a tight space where I don't have a, enough premium, I'll buy the thirty. That's the smallest I would buy. All right, and that's you know what twenty five hundred. So let's look at the gold price. I'm just trying to help you guys out in a, in anticipation of the season. Season pass basic is two thousand gold. That um, special deal is what six fifty. 600 it's less than it's less it's like 83 gold a day a great deal so season pass 2000 for the basic if you need now we don't know what's coming up yet in the ultimate so at this point you can buy the, the season pass regular 2000 and then once you get that or you'll need to have premium time you don't need to have it. It'll just be better. Trust me. It'll go better for your season. If you do have premium time, buy the 600 premium time. Now you have to buy the premium time before it expires. It will expire. That offer will expire before the season comes out. So Monday evening, 10, 11 o'clock at night, whatever, buy the premium then because it'll start from the moment you buy it. So I would buy it late Monday evening, Tuesday, by the season pass, 2000. And if you decide you want the extra stuff that whatever it is that's offered, we got an awesome tank last time. It was for the 6,000, which is 4,000 additional. And you can do, you can either buy it as one unit, which is the 6,000 ultimate, or you can buy the regular and then the 4,000 price just makes up the difference. I got ultimate because I bought the basic and then I added the 4,000. No big deal. It doesn't charge you anymore. Either way is fine. But for sure, I would say get the season pass because of all the things you get. 2,000 for that, 600. So you're gonna need 2,600 gold to do this. The 3,000 gold pack, 15 bucks, good, great deal. Because remember, when you buy season pass, the 2,000 gold it cost you will be given back to you if, when you get through section like 90 whatever you finish the whole thing you're going to get 2100 gold back so you're making a hundred dollars a hundred gold profit just by completing the season which is not very difficult a couple of three weeks if you're you know a medium um activity player four or five weeks if you're a little more casual it's easy to do it's not a problem you're going to get a lot of killer items you're going to have the gold plus you're going to get four cards based upon this season. Let's go back to this season and I'll show it to you. We're going to go backwards. This is at stage 100 here. You see the uh, orange outline. You go backwards at stage 90. We're going to, you'll see the last of the two cards that come up. This is the red and the blue. There'll be another black and another blue card. And those will total a minimum for the four cards will be 1,000 gold. And it could be more if you get lucky. Most people will get more than 1,000, but the worst you can get is 1,000. There's also like seven, eight, or nine days of premium time built into the season pass as you go through it. So let's go through here. I'm not worried about that. You got some commanders you pick up for free, which are awesome. There's the black card, and there's one more blue card. These are cosmetic vouchers, tremendous stuff. 
Let's go back here. Commander experience. Those are awesome. There is the final card. Well, I'm going backwards. So this is the fourth card. So you're going to get, if next season is the same as this season, and you can go look through it, it will be the same. It was the same the season before that. So it should be 2100 gold for just coins. Just the coins as you progress through the season. Doing the season, I mean the daily ops or the weekly ops. 2100 gold coins. 2100 in gold coins. Plus four cards totaling 1000 minimum. So you're going to get 3,100 gold on the absolute minimum just from the season that you pay 2,000 gold for that. It's a no-brainer. That's 1,100 free gold that you're going to get. So what you do, if you bought, like I said, if you bought the, uh, if you had no gold, you bought 15, a $15 pack of gold to get 3,000 gold. The Monday evening, you would buy the premium time seven the seven days of premium time if you haven't bought it before then Tuesday you come on there buy the season pass bingo and then you know that will cost you 600 plus 2,000 2,600 you still have 400 gold and then you are able to go to town let's go back I'm look at the season here one more time let's go all the way to the back and then just see how fast the gold accrues it'll take a few seconds here to cycle through this and get all the way back there but all those gold and silver coins are awesome those silvers are like a thousand I mean a hundred thousand hundred fifty thousand sometimes two hundred thousand those blue commander experience point tokens are awesome well I don't know if it was this one I'm looking yes uh, no that's a emblem but see this is an emblem that you get and you may have this emblem right but you're gonna get the voucher for it that's the key um, also, there's one thing that show up that I didn't mention today. I was just to throw it in there. There are camouflage vouchers. And a camouflage voucher is really valuable because if you try to put camouflage on a premium tank, it'll cost you 200 gold for a permanent. Camouflage voucher, it's free. So every time you see a camouflage voucher, that's a 200 gold token, essentially to camo a premium tank. It's cheaper, you can put permanent camo on a tech tree tank for silver, no problem. Just a little helpful hint. Okay, so, silver, 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 and then stage six, you get gold, one seven. Just, you know, quickly. So it's all good. You gotta get gold right off the bat in the first day or two. Camo for this is the 200. 200, to 200 gold token, essentially. This was awesome. This is an advanced loader that you're going to get a tank at some point. And you hang on to this for a high tier tank where it's going to be five or 600,000 silver to shove this in one of your tanks. So you wouldn't put this in like some tier, tier three or four guy. You just pay for that in straight silver. It's cheaper. The higher tier guys, especially the Cold War guys, it's going to cost you a fortune five six hundred thousand plus so another helpful hint so this is kind of the basic idea hey I think oh. so this is the basic idea to help you plan out what you're gonna do which will help you throughout the season so hopefully this helps you out a lot, and thanks for stopping by. I'll see you guys in the next one.